Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Tricia and I'm excited to share this sleek wall clock slash desk clock that I made. It's easy and it's budget friendly. So I want to show you exactly how I did it. Plus, I'm doing a giveaway. Guys, you don't want to miss this. This is worth $180. You want to stay tuned so you can enter into this contest. So the first thing we want to do is drill a hole in the plaque. So this plaque is seven inches long. I'm just going to measure it to find the center of it and then place a mark in the center. Now I'm going to use a five eighths of an inch drill bit and I'm going to drill a hole in the center. Next, we want to separate the hoop. So I got this embroidery hoop. It's 12 inches in diameter and all I'm doing is separating the two and I'm only going to use the center. Now it's time to spray paint. I didn't show on camera me spray painting, but you're going to spray paint the plaque as well as um, get four popsicle sticks out and the embroidery hoop and you're just going to spray paint it in rose gold. Now it's time to add the clock numbers. So the ones that I got um, had a self-adhesive backing on it. You just place it on there, spray paint it in rose gold. Now we're going to position the popsicle sticks where we would like it and we want to match it up to the numbers that we just put on there. So after you do that, you want to add the hoop on top and then just slide the popsicle sticks under the hoop. So make sure on the sides the popsicle sticks doesn't go past the hoop. If so, just push it back in. Now that we've done that, we want to take the center out and then start adding uh, wood glue and you can use any wood glue that works for you. I'm using the Rapid Fuse wood adhesive and just add it to the tips. And then just place the center plaque, make sure it's aligned correctly and press down and let it dry before you remove the hoop. So now that you remove the hoop, you want to put glue on the tips of it and then put the hoop back. Now that that's dry, you want to flip over the clock and we're going to attach the clock movement piece. And all you're going to do is just flip it over and put the center in the hole, then turn it around. It should look something like this. Then you want to start putting your hands on there. You want to make sure you read the instructions on the kit, but put your short hand on there first, then the long hand. Screw those two in. Then place your second hand on there. And you're finished. And this is what it looks like on the wall. It's very simple, elegant, and pretty. It's giveaway time. Guys, I wanted to take this opportunity to say thank you, thank you, and thank you for all the wonderful comments, ideas, suggestions, photos of the projects that you have done. You guys are so amazing and I truly appreciate you. So my way of giving back is working with Jord Watches, which is a company that was founded in 2013 and they focus on watches from natural materials. Okay, I know you wanna know. How can I enter? All you have to do is click on the link in the description box below, put in your full name as well as your email address, and you'll be notified whether you're the winner or not. You'll have until February the 12th to enter and someone will be selected by midnight. So if you are the winner, you will receive $180 store credit and it comes with free shipping of a watch of your choice on their website. So make sure you go and check it out. If you don't win, there is going to be a coupon code in the description box that you can use towards your purchase. So look at one of their watches, guys. This is the turquoise and zebra wood watch. And look at the detail on that. Isn't that so unique and beautiful? This is a show stopper. Talk about quality. I so, 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 so love unique items. 
and take a look at the back of it. You can see the gear is moving and it's not battery operated at all. And look at the wood. Very pretty, right? And it has like crystals on the inside. You can kind of see the gears on the front of it too. So before you get your watch, they will ask you for your wrist size. So you just take the measuring tape and give them um, the measurement and they will adjust the watch to your size. So you don't have to worry about taking links out at all, which is awesome. So in, inside the box, you will get some extra links in there if you decide to adjust it to a different size as well as instructions on how to maintain um, the watch because it's a wood watch. You wanna take extra care because this is not just any kind of watch. So please click on the link in the description box so that you can be entered into the contest. What a great way to treat yourself for Valentine's Day. Thanks guys for watching. Let's connect on Instagram. I'm at Designs by Tricia. I would love to see your DIY projects. So make sure you tag me. Also, check out my other videos. I think you'll like it.